Guess what, you guys? I went to Barnes & Noble and I had a nice big surprise with the magazine stand. There's a new Fangoria out, issue, no issue number 317. I wasn't expecting it to be out. On honesty, I'm horrible at looking at their website or their Facebook fan page and seeing their release date. So here's a close-up of her. I kind of really like this cover. I like it better than the other one, even though the last one was Resident Evil. Kind of like the 2D versus 3D-ness. Also show you the back. That is the back. Shoo. So I now will have two magazines to read this weekend. I am having one ordered in through eBay, which will get here tomorrow-ish. Which they didn't leave a card in my box, which annoys me. But that's a whole separate issue. So I hope you guys have a good day. I guess until next time. Okay, I just opened up a Fangoria issue 317, and usually I don't show what's inside magazines, but I had to show this. Tales from the Crypt, people. It is back. It is coming. It is from October 5th, from 10 p.m. to 12 a.m. on Fearnet. I'm hoping it's new. I'm hoping they're bringing the new ones out. If it's new, that'd be awesome. If it's the old ones... Not as awesome, because I own all the old ones, but still, the thought of Tales of the Crypt coming back, oh, I think my whole year has been made completely. Yes. So I will look further into it to actually see if it's new or if it's just the older ones, but either way, the fact that there's Tales of the Crypt in this magazine is a brilliant sign of how much I'm going to love it. Yay. And as the contents, if you want to really know what's in it, read it for yourself, pause it. There you go. But that, that, that is the star of the show today, folks. Tales of the Crypt, coming to you soon.